Welcome back, everybody. When we last left off, I was working on the windows. So this is the bathroom. So I have, probably have a small shower over there, toilet over here, but for win I want to put a window in here. But you, you want to have a little privacy, I think. So I think I'm going to do this. Cut this out. So that'll be the window. We'll do that, yeah. Yeah, so a little, I guess that's a transom window across the top, so it gives you privacy, but you can, you know, still get light in. Now this here, I'm picturing as like the maid or the butler's quarters over here. I thought about digging under and making a basement. And putting the quarters down there, but I'm not sure about that yet. Maybe I should think about that more. I don't know what's down, what's underneath here. I mean, is there enough room down here for a basement? Maybe. I'm just trying to see if I'm going to run into anything down here. No, that should give me enough room all the way down there. Let's dig this way for a little bit. So I don't know what's down here. I don't think there's anything down here. Yeah, this will be fine. There's plenty of room down here. And I, I think it's run. I was afraid I was going to run into some other part of the city but i think we're good down here so i th think we'll put like a um, so there'll be a stairway here so i guess yeah so this whole area can be a stairway that means i could probably make the bathroom a little bigger so we'll have to work on that little floor plan for that for bathroom and uh basement area and then in the basement we can have a few rooms one for like the cook the maid and the butler down there and put in like a wine cellar and some other safe and that kind of some other uh, rooms down there because it's a little more secure kind of like a fallout shelter but that would be yeah so that'll go down here we really don't need yeah so we'll put a floor here yeah so i think that'll work we'll have a stairway down there and so this leaves the kitchen over here. So we'll work on this later. This will be later on once I figure out what I'm doing. When I start working on the bathroom, we'll figure out what space we need. Because I want like a full bath here. Well, actually, I don't need a full bath here, do I? If I'm having the... Sur well, I need a, a partial bath here for the guests. But down underneath with the... In the basement where the servants and stuff... and Or less living i can put in the full bathroom down there i was putting the full bath here because i thought the butler would need it from over here but he doesn't or she, well, i guess it's, the butler would be he the house maid housekeeper head housekeeper would be the female version of the butler because they keep track of the house I don't know, I'd probably rather have the head housekeeper than the butler, because the butler always did it, right? <laughs> um, let's see there. So I have a window here. How do I elevate that? Oh, right there. I wonder what I'm doing there. Yeah, so let's see. Yeah, and I can put some a bunch of shelves and stuff in here for storage. So I think that would be okay. We'll still have like the wine and stuff down below. Something like that. Don't really need to worry about the bottom because I think I'm going to have counters or like a stove in front of there. 
And then I think here, Oh, maybe I'll do the transom window again up here. Because it lets in light, but it frees up the lower part of the wall so I can have, you know, um, counters and stuff. There. Okay, so the kitchen and dining room. How do I want to do the dining room? Maybe here and here. Like, how do I want that big a window in the dining room? Yeah, I'm not sure if I want that big a window in the dining room. If I do something like this. Window there. Window here. And... A window, yeah, a window here. Here, window here, and window, window there. Let's just do this. Nope, I can't do that, can I? Yeah, they're not as fancy as the other windows, but I think that'll be fine since it is the dining room. And we have that area there, so. So that's the windows. Oh, and I think I want a window in here. Like this. And this one's a little fancier than the other one. There, there, there. There. Oops, let's not do that. Let's take this one off and do that. Oh, no, I don't want a full block. I want a half block. There. And maybe something like that. Yeah, and then there can be like some tables and stuff there to put your hats and shoes or whatever when you come in the front door. And there'll be a big front door here. And this front door. Okay. Like that. And well, do, do I want anything else above it? Is 
So that's the door. So I think no. There. Okay. Doing a bit of trim, and then there'll be a roof up above this on top of the porch. So there'll be a porch here, and then there'll be a, a porch roof on top of there. And that'll go there, and I think, yeah, something like that. Okay, so we still need to get the second floor set up. The more I thought of it, I think what I'm going to do. Is oh, I need oh, I do need two pieces of concrete or powder. Where's that at? So the green and the gray. Do I not have any gray? Oh, there's gray. Green and gray that and then this second floor will actually be here so there's gonna be a little bit of gap between the first and second floors but I think that will work out better in my favor here because then I will have a nice smooth floor to work with not gonna have to worry about you know because this floor's got all these little wall gaps from the first floor That does mean I need to raise this up. So this will go up a little bit higher. Probably need to, yeah. Yeah, I guess I could just do this. And then I'll just put a, maybe some more on top. Maybe not, I haven't figured that out. Okay, so we got our floor here. It's good. And then I guess to get started on this, we'll do like that. I thought maybe we could do something like this. Maybe that would be a window. And we could do the same thing here. Like that. Yeah, no window here. And then maybe. window here. Actually, will that be a window? No, yeah, so they just have the window there and then we'll have a bigger window over here, I guess. So this would be a window right here. The one Actually, I really can't lay out the window until I get all the walls in. So I guess I can just cut them up. Yeah, I could just break them up the way I was going to. I mean, put all the walls there and then break them up as I need the windows to go through. Maybe... Yeah, like that. And I'm going to want to break up the walls inside too. 
Just trying to think of how we want to do this. If we do one there. Is that right? Yeah, that'll be fine. But I don't know. I don't need that. I'm trying to keep this in my mind here. That. And that. Let's take a quick look. See how that looks. Yeah, that does look... I think, yeah, I'll need to cut that down, I guess, right there. And then I'll need to find, I need, I do need to find something to go around to break that up. Maybe it'll be like a mud brick stair, kind of make a ledge there. Oh, I see what I did. Yeah, so if I take all these out. Yeah, I think that that will be good. So then I can take all these out too. Is that right? Yeah, take this out. I may need to grow um, grow some more jungle trees because I don't know how much jungle wood I have. But this will be, yeah, this is much more, so it's going to be more like it. So then on the corners, have something like this. I may need to go up one more. Yeah, I think I need to go up one more. And then we'll do it on all these corners, I guess. Oh, all these corners. <laughs> Okay, that gets us a floor, oops, a floor, once I put the board back in. So we have some nice oak flooring for the second story. And then we've got the walls all up with this kind of a decoration to combine the bottom bricks with the top, which is the jungle wood. And I'm definitely going to have to put in probably right about here a ledge or something to, to kind of differentiate the bottom from the top and not make it as smooth because it looks really flat right now and I'm not sure the best way to unflatten it let's see can I do these I can do these so we see so maybe if we do Something like, oops, oh, come on. Can I do this? There we go. Well, not like that. Boy, who would have thought that'd be so hard? Let's, um, Is my scaffolding. Let's 
Yeah, so if I put these stairs here, this will put a nice little ledge. I'll have to make sure it's lit enough so it doesn't uh, have anything spawning on it. But that should be fine with the windows there. Going to get enough light from inside. And that looks a lot better that way. Yeah, so that's going to look a lot, a lot better. I just have to make some more mud bricks. Yeah, that, that'll work. That'll work fine. And I think if I put jungle or some other block there, it'll look, it'll just kind of stand out too much. But this is just enough that it kind of blends in with everything else. Okay, so I think that is getting us started. Uh, I'm going to call it for a day because I think we're out of time for this episode and we'll just keep uh, pressing on and continuing to uh, build on this house as we go along. So I thank you all for watching. Hope you're having a great day and I will see you later. Bye bye.